What's the deal, y'all? This your man, King Eric, the media assassin, coming at y'all with another video. Be sure to subscribe and like button for me. And I want to ask you guys this. This is doing a lot to my Texas base out there. What is the 411, and what is the deal behind this beef between Zero and Trade the Truth? Now, from what I'm observing, this may cause a divide within Texas. Both of these guys are hugely respected. Both of these guys have made classic music together, classic albums together. But being that I've been busy as of late, what caused the divide and what caused the beef? And why is this still going on 20 years later almost? From what I'm hearing, though, this may hurt Trade the Truth's image. I mean, the brother has done a lot of great community work in Texas. He he comes across as a real stand-up guy. But this whole situation with him and Zero is going to definitely cause a division because Zero's a respected dude, like Mr. One Deep himself. So the way this is looking out, a fight broke out at 50 Cent's party in Texas. And the remaining clip was we saw Zero hunched down, getting hit by one of Trader Truth's guys. Now, from what I'm observing, what I'm hearing, Trader Truth claims that it was nobody jumped Zero, even though Zero claimed he jumped him. But now some new footage came out. I can't post it on the on the on the page because you know I don't want to get flagged. You know, you know how these YouTube laws are. Certain channels can do that, but I can't. But you will see people jumping on zero. And Trade the Truth, from what I'm observing, is right there. Trade the Truth said that nobody jumped them, but now the video footage leaked. Now, here's another thing that's happening. Now people are calling zero a snitch. And this is where I have to say this. Y'all keep putting snitch on all the stupidest narratives out there. He got jumped on tape. He didn't point no names out. Nobody got indicted. Nobody's getting in trouble because of that. Zero went on there and he just basically described exactly what was on video. How is that snitching? He's on tape. Like, what do you want him to do? Say he didn't get jumped? <laughs> And even when he did his press, he didn't point no names out. He didn't say, oh, Trey, the truth hit me. He didn't say any of that. None. So, what are we going with that? That's not snitching at all. He's just describing a situation. That's occurring, and it happens to be on tape. Like, you can't call that man a snitch. But where it is going from here, Trade the Truth is going to take a hit, image-wise. All that stuff he was doing, he going to have to really go double on giving out those turkeys. The turkey drive going to have to cost double now because zero from from what people have said about him, about the state of Texas, is a real solid dude. And where this is going to go, I do not know. But hopefully cooler heads can prevail and there could be some type of peace, peace treaty can come with this. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Subscribe and the like button, peace.